digestive system introduction to digestive system digestive system is one of the most crucial organ system of our body without it we will not be able to digest our food while studying the digestive system we get to know about the digestion process which is occurring inside our body there are seven organs in the digestive system seven organs of the digestive system esophagus stomach liver gall bladder pancreas small intestine large intestine esophagus also known as food pipe the role of esophagus is to transfer the food particles from the mouth to the digestive system it is also known as food pipe it is a flattened muscular tube attached from your mouth to the stomach there are also some common problems that occur related to the food pipe such as heartburn acid reflux etc these occur when the acid of the stomach flows and touches the lower part of the esophagus stomach stomach is the main part of the digestive system it is a j shaped muscular pouch which receives food particles from the esophagus and sends to the small intestine when the food goes into the stomach it gets mixed with enzymes and churned and totally become a liquid this liquid is called chyme stomach also has a enzyme named pepsin which is used to digest meat liver liver makes a digestive juice called bile that helps to digest some fats and vitamins bile ducts carry bile to the gall bladder for storage or small intestine for use it is roughly triangular and red in color hepatitis is one of the diseases related to liver gall bladder the gall bladder stores bile which is made by the liver and squeezes it to the small intestine for use it is a pear shaped hollow structure located under the liver at the right side of the abdomen it is green in color pancreas the pancreas is only 6 inches long just like a hand the main function of the pancreas is to produce enzymes and break down food particles rich in fats proteins vitamins and minerals the pancreas produces 8 ounces of enzymes filled with digestive juices every day it also works with bile which is produced by the liver to break down fats small intestine the small intestine is a 24 foot long muscular tube which connects the stomach and the large intestine water is absorbed by the small intestine the main work of the small intestine is to separate the nutritional food and waste food it sends the nutritional food to the blood stream and the waste food to the large intestine large intestine the large intestine plays a very important role in the digestive system once the small intestine sends the waste food to the large intestine it sends all the waste food out of the body through the anus in the form of stool the large intestine is not longer than the small intestine